just gonna ask him a couple questions about the Constitution and all that stuff. Do you, do you know what intolerable acts are? What, what is intolerable acts? No. So an example of intolerable, intolerable acts would be the Boston Tea Party, okay. which was when a bunch of colonists dressed up as natives and they threw Great Britain's tea into the ocean, which was like millions of dollars. Sure. Uh, and another, another example would be the Boston Massacre, was when five troops were lined up and they gunned down five men, which were unarmed. She's a junior in college, I mean, a fresh, <laughs> freshman in college, and we're just gonna ask you a couple of questions. Okay. So, uh, just, do you know what intolerable acts are? Okay, okay. Um, so an, an example of intolerable acts would be the Boston Tea Party, which was when a bunch of colonists dressed up as natives and they threw up like Great Britain's tea inside the ocean, which cost millions of dollars of damage and all that stuff. And then it would also be the Boston Massacre. It was when five troops were lined up and they gunned down five men, which were unarmed. And yeah. All right, I'm here with Hannah. We're gonna ask her a couple questions. Do you know some of the intolerable acts? No. All right, so one of them is the Boston Tea Party, where colonists dressed up as natives and threw Great, Brit Great Britain's tea into the ocean, costing them a million dollars. Another one is about the Boston Massacre, where um, colonists shot five people and it kind of just like started a, started a big rumble. Alex, do you know when the, the, the U.S. gained its independence? No way. It was in 1776. <laughs> Three. Alright, we're back here with Drew and I'm going to ask him another question. Drew, do you know when, do you know who Thomas Jefferson was? I do. Who was it? Second president. Uh, do you know what some of his accomplishments were? Uh, I know that he was one of the writers of the Constitution, the Declaration of Independence, um, and he fought for, I forget the party, but it was, he was adversaries with uh, Kerr. Kerr were on different sides of the island. Jefferson was more of a farmer's populist politician. Cool, thank you. So we're here at HB with Melissa, and we're gonna ask her a couple questions about the U.S. Um, do you know who the first president of the United States was? No. Just take, just take a guess. Um, wait, not Washington. Well, you see, most people think it's George Washington, but it's actually not. It's George. It's a. Uh, it's John Hanson. John Hanson. That's his name. <laughs> his name's John Hanson. Um. And do you know what year, what year America gained its independence in? Um, no. Uh, just take a guess. It's 1776. Yeah, that's actually right. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> okay, good job. All right, thank you so much. <laughs>